Hey, what is going on everyone? This is Lunatic and this is a 42 gun streak with the M27 assault rifle playing some multi-team kill confirmed this time on the map drone. So definitely switching up the weapons, the game types, and the maps for you guys. You know, it's not raid, domination, PDW, load star, dog, swarm type stuff. So hope you guys do enjoy this gameplay in the uh, in the background. But what I want to talk about in this commentary, last night... I, as I'm making this commentary last night, so Saturday night, I got, I just got home, I, I watched the movie, and I just got home, and I was bored, so I wanted to get on and play Call of Duty, but I didn't want to go for gameplays, and I wanted just to do something fun, so I got a bright idea, and what I wanted to do was go to Ground War and get a full party and try to find those shit-talking, you know, try-hard, elite clan dudes and just try to wreck them and make them rage quit. So that's what I did. I got on Twitter. I was like, hey, I'm you know, looking for a full party. And actually, a lot of people responded uh, right off the start. So it was really good. And I played with a bunch of YouTubers, a bunch of friends that are actually in Amp Clan. I played with Cold Side of Pillow, The Cod Robot, Sledgeify, Necros, Matt Coat, who's another small YouTuber. He's actually in this game with me right now, the one that you're watching. And a few other people. And we finally got nine. And we went to Ground War. And we played some tryhards, and they all rage quit, and you know it was really fun. I was running uh, UAV counter lightning strike. Everybody was running low streaks. You know all the non-lethals, guardians, lightning strikes, uh, hellstorm stuff like that. All the really low streaks. Nobody was running high streaks, and it was actually really fun. And it got me to thinking. You know, I'm actually having fun playing Black Ops 2. Maybe I should do this more often. And at this point, you know everybody's already. Using support, well, I'm not going to say everybody, but a lot of people are already using support in this game, and I thought, you know, maybe I should too. Now, I use support in Modern Warfare 3 because when I started my YouTube channel, everybody was already posting triple MOABs with support, and there was no point in me sitting there playing solo going to ground war, playing downturn team deathmatch and outpost kill confirmed, just waiting and waiting and waiting for bootleg domination to come up so I could try to get a double Moab solo when I could just get a support party, get bootleg domination right off the start and get a triple Moab which was going to get more views and more subscribers for me anyway. So that's why I use support in Modern Warfare 3 is because everybody was already using it when I started my YouTube channel. And then everybody's like, oh my god, Lunatic, you only use support. So your channel is going to die when Black Ops 2 comes out because there's weapons to balance and this and that. And you know what? My channel's doing just fine. It's actually like more than doubled in size since Black Ops 2 came out. And, you know, it's I think I'm, you know, proving that I really don't need a ballistic vest to get a kill at this point or a VSAT to get a kill. I've been playing solo. I've been posting nothing but solo gameplays on my channel. Um, I think I've posted four or five multi-team gameplays where I'm actually playing in a small party of, you know, obviously three people. So, uh, like, all my gameplays are solo, so I don't see why... You know, I shouldn't start using support because one, it's going to be fun for me. I'm actually going to have fun playing. Two, I'm going to be able to get sick gameplays to post on my YouTube channel. Most likely some like sick gameplays like 120 plus non-lethals, triple nuclear, stuff like that. Um, it's just, you know, fun stuff. And then I'll be able to act, interact with my subscribers more because, you know... Obviously, I'm going to need nine people or eight more people to play, and I'll tweet it out. I'll post a video. I'll be like, hey, if you want to run support, you know, message me, and I'll be able to interact with you guys. And then also, I might even, if I do enjoy it and do like it, then I might even be able to start streaming again. So that's what I want to ask you guys in this commentary. Should I start using support parties in Black Ops 2? Now, obviously, I don't need it. Um, I can still get nuclears and gameplays and gun streaks and hundred pluses and whatnot, but it's you know it's one of those things where it's like oh my god, you're using support, you're bad. I don't you know I don't want to I don't want people to think that. So just let me know what you think in the comment sections below, and I'm out. Peace.